Hello friends, welcome to AutoCAD video tutorials. I am Prabhu, you are watching this video from CyberCADSolutions.com. Today in this session, I am going to explain how to draw a rectangle in AutoCAD. There are three different methods to draw a rectangle in AutoCAD. First one is providing two opposite corners. Second one is area method. Third one is using dimensions that is length and width. If you want to use tool button, go to draw group and pick on the tool button over here. Let us try the first option providing two corners. The shortcut command for rectangle is REC. Type REC at command prompt and press enter. Now the AutoCAD is asking to specify first corner point. I am using my mouse and clicking on the screen like this. Now if you observe at the command prompt, it is asking to specify other corner. Use your mouse and pick another corner like this, you will get the rectangle. But how to draw a rectangle with required length and width? Let us see that method. Here is this one. Again type REC at command prompt and press enter. Now when it asks, when it is asking to specify first corner, pick a corner like this. And when it asks for opposite corner or other corner, enter your input like this at the rate length comma width at the rate length that is 20 units comma width 15 units and press enter you will get a rectangle as shown on the screen now to ensure that we got required length and width we will use dist command to measure type dist at command prompt and press enter pick start point of one side and end point of the same side you can observe it is 20 units. Similarly, DIST, type again and press enter. Measure the width, this point and this point. You can say it is 15 units length. So this is how to get a rectangle with required length and width. Okay, what is the second method? In the second method, while providing area, we need to provide one more dimension that is either length or width also. Let us try the second option. Type REC at command prompt and press enter. When it is asking to specify first corner point, pick the first corner and you will get different options on the command prompt. We have area, dimensions and rotation options. Take area option. You can type capital A or click on this option. I am typing capital A and press enter. A, which for area. Now it is asking to enter the area of rectangle in current units. Let us say I have 150 units area. I would like to draw a rectangle with 150 units. So type 150 at command prompt and press enter. Now it is asking what will you give length or width? Current option is length. So we shall go with length option where we will provide length as 15 units. So to tell the AutoCAD that I'm going to provide length, you have to select this length option. Click on the length. Now it will ask to enter the rectangle length. I am giving 15 units and press enter. You can see a rectangle has been drawn. So what are the inputs we have provided to AutoCAD to draw this rectangle? 150 units area and 15 units length. So that the width of the rectangle would be 10 units. So let us measure both the length and width. So use DIST command. Type DIST and press enter. Measure start point of length and end point of length. You can see that 15 units is drawn for length. Again DIST, press enter. Pick first point and second point, point on the width. You can see 10 units. This is useful when we know area and one of the dimension of rectangle. Then we will go to third method, dimensions method. In this method, we have to provide length as well as width also. Along with that, we have to provide the location also. Let us see how to do this. Type REC at command prompt and press enter. It is asking to provide first corner point. Pick somewhere on the screen, then take dimensions option. Type D at command prompt and press enter. Now it is asking to specify length of rectangle say 20 units is length press type 20 and press enter now it is asking to specify width of rectangle on the command prompt let us give some 15 units 
and press enter now again there is something else is being asked at the command prompt specify other corner point means in which direction you want this rectangle you just move your cursor like this it will show the preview of rectangle which is going to be placed you can pick anywhere so that that rectangle will come up so i am clicking over here because i want rectangle to be placed over here click there and you will get the rectangle the command will be terminated so this is how using dimensions method but rather than using the dimensions method the first method is very useful let us see that one more time type rec at command prompt pick first corner point for the second corner point simply type at the rate length comma width and press enter you will get directly the rectangle with given length and width so hope you understood how to draw a rectangle in autocad if you like this video please share this video link to your friends that is from cybercad solutions and if you have any doubts please email me to my mail id cybercadprabhu@gmail.com thanks for watching welcome to next video